We love a 9 to 5 job. Okay, so here are my luggages and peep and paprika and I'm going to put away all my clothes in this closet. This section is my sister's and this part of the closet will be mine and I'm gonna hang like all my clothes there. Oh yeah, that's better. So hi everyone, just want to update you guys that I just got to KL and I have finally moved into my sister's apartment. Yes, I'll be staying here for a while but not sure how long because it depends on my job. And good news, I got a job. Not sure if it counts as a job. I'll be doing like a marketing intern at a company in KL. So I'm very excited and I'll be starting my job in a few days. For now, I still have like a few more days to you know rest and unpack all my stuff. So I'm excited to show you guys my journey here, my work life, if I can film, if, if it's possible. So yeah, and 2022 will be in two days. Just wanna wish you guys happy new year. Comment down below what is your 2022 goal. My 2022 goal is to be <laughs> my 2022 goal is to film more, post more on YouTube, and just just go on with my life. And this is Lilith by the way. She's disturbing me filming. My vlog. So I already hung away some of the clothes But I don't have enough hangers so I have to buy them more Before I start organizing my books I'm gonna show you guys all the books that I brought from home So I brought a total of 7 books The first one I brought is The Last Magician by Lisa Maxwell and I also brought The End of Man, The Night Circus, Vengeful by V. E. Schwab. So this is the second book in the villain series, The Wisteria Society of Lady Scoundrel by India Holton, It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover, and Dance of Thieves by Mary E. Pearson. So these are all the books that I have prioritized on my TBR list so hopefully I can start reading them um, as soon as I start working you can see here this shelf is quite full so I'm gonna try and make some space for my book decided to organize them like horizontally so it looks prettier like this yeah, the lighting here is not bad okay just to update right now we are going to pavilion we're going to watch spider-man no way home i already watched the movie and this will be my second time watching it and my sister she hasn't watched the movie yet she's super excited about it and after watching the movie, we are going to grab a late lunch. Oh, I forgot, sorry. What are we eating again? No, let's eat now. Okay, we're probably gonna eat now because our. <laughs> Wait, what time is, uh, is our show? 2.50. Yeah. The show is 
at 2.50 and now it's like 2 o'clock so we have around like one hour until the movie starts.
some ice chocolate for breakfast. Hi guys, I'm not sure when was the last time I spoken to you. Yesterday, um, after dinner, me and my sister, we decided to go for an impromptu karaoke. And we had lots of fun. So, and right now, I'm all dolled up, but we're gonna go out and have Tokyo ramen. And also, let me show you guys my outfit of the day. So this is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing like a blue cardigan, like this printed um, top with my Longchamp handbag, red color, I bought it for my sister. And I'm wearing this like corduroy pants. And I'm wearing my Converse sneakers. You want to show your platypus shoes, your Perry the platypus shoes? No. I'm showing it. No. Okay, also, just to update you guys, I have finally finished reading You and Me on Vacation. This is by Emily Henry and I gave this book 2 out of 5 stars. I really think this book is super boring. This book follows two characters named Poppy and Alex. They're both best friends. Poppy works at a magazine company. She travels to places and then she has to write articles about the places that she travels to. And whenever she travels, she will usually bring Alex. This book talks about the 12 summers that they spent together. And in one of the summers, um, Poppy and Alex like had a fight. Let me tell you, it took so long for me to get to the part where they had the fight. And when I got to the explanation part where they, you know, they had the fight, it was nothing. It was just like, oh, Poppy and Alex, they were like kissing each other and then Alex like got mad or something. It's so hard to write like a good story with like two different timelines because you need to make sure they're both connected and they make sense and has like deeper meaning, not just like like a casual fight or something. I don't know, but I don't like this book. Like, this book also doesn't show you, it just tells you. It's literally about the title, like you and me on vacation, literally about Poppy and Alex going you know, traveling, going to places, and a lot of description of the places which I don't like about it, which I think they're like redundant, they bore me so much. And I'm not sure why this book warned the 2021 good hey, uh. Shut up. Yes, I am a hater. I won't read her other books. Like the love hypothesis is much more fun. The story, I know it's like cringy, but it's like much more fun and it's about like grad schools. You know, there's like a niche concept. This one is just like typical story. I can write this story. Like I can just, you know, write about the places I go with my best friends and then like one summer I had a fight with my guy best friend because you know something bad happened. Like Anyone can write like a story like this, like come on, I need something good, like something fun that can get me out of the reading slum. So if you know any book that can help me get out of the reading slum, please do let me know. If you want to recommend me a romance book, please recommend me books that are interesting, not like this one. if we're trespassing but yeah
Mira. Oh. What did you order? Okay, I ordered carbonara. Spinach ravioli. Tomato, tomato based, and yanchi chichi, right? The one that yanchi. Where? 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 Mm, I, every time I, I try something, I, if I, I saw like a different book, I can't teach it. Is this up to you? Yeah, what would Ramsey pay? Yeah. Is this up to this? I'm confused now. Like you're going to make which one available. Dessert time! 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 Dessert time